Now, there's a strong reaction also coming from Kangana Ranao, the Bharti Janata Party's candidate from Mandi in Himachal Pradesh. She slammed the Congress party on this entire Kachatibu Rao. She said Nehru called Aksai Chin a barren land and made a whole host of other accusations as well. Let me, in fact, go across to Meenakshi, who will take us through the reaction that's come in from Kangana Ranao. Yes, Meenakshi. Well, yes, Siddharth. So let's uh, take our viewers through the reaction which has been put out by Kangana Ranao. Uh, as you rightly said, that the politics over Kachatibu escalating after Digvijay Singh's remark, there is a counter which has come from the side of Kangana Ranao. She says, and I'm quoting a verbatim, uh, Nehruji think, Nehruji's thinking rather of calling Aksai Chin a barren land is still alive in the Congress. Digvijay's statement regarding Kachatibu Island reflects that same mentality and thinking. She goes on to say that due to this mentality, development could not take place in the remote areas of India under the Congress rule. But this is a new India where tap water is reaching country's highest polling station, etc. Finally, goes on to say that there will be no compromise with geographical integrity of the country, meaning under the NDA government, and the country will definitely give a reply to those who have such a mentality and thinking. So, Kangana are not taking a jibe at the Congress party over Digvijay Singh's remarks. She's put out this tweet in Hindi. We read out, of course, an English translation. And Kangana Ranaut in that tweet basically summons summation of her attack, saying that Digvijay's statement, quote-unquote, reflects Congress's mentality.